What's up, guys? It's your boy TB Hops here, and I have got my latest edition from EWIN. Uh, the Champion Series fabric model. So it's rated for people up to six foot one. Uh, you know, so right in my high range. A uh, little background on myself so that you know, uh, you know, if you're a similar build or have similar issues. So I am six feet tall. 160 pounds, fairly slim, uh, cross-country runner back in high school, didn't take care of my body, you know, athletes, you know, wear and tear, uh, so lower back support is super important to me, and, uh, you know, finding the right chair, you know, the pillow does a really good job of it, of, uh, support compared to a lot of just basic cheapo chairs, so. And then, of course, uh, you know, a little headrest pillow uh, just to help not strain your neck as much. But, you know, uh, in terms of the chair itself, uh, you may notice right off the get-go, uh, it's got a lean forward a uh, good bit. You know, a lot of the chairs, uh, they don't lean forward this much. This actually has a five-degree tilt forward, uh, which is perfect for when you kind of need to have that high motivation office chair style. Uh, so, you know, that's what that EWIN offers that very few uh, other brands offer. And, of course, it tilts back to like 150, 160 degree tilt. I had to lay back for naps and stuff or just, you know, de-stress for a moment. So, uh, another thing you'll probably notice right off the bat, uh, it's got the lever system up here, like a lot of, uh, you know, the higher end chairs do nowadays. And then, of course, being fabric, uh, you don't have the two little slots, even though this is still a racing seat style. Uh, you don't have the two little slots, so you don't have the straps for the lumbar pillow. Not an issue for me. Honestly, the straps are annoying because, for some reason, they only hold the pillow in the wrong spot. So the straps get in the way, I feel like, a lot more than they should. So no straps. Honestly, it's fine. And... You know, constantly had to readjust the ones that I've had with straps. So, you know, once you get the pillow in the right spot, it stays, you know, until you move. So, uh, another thing you might notice right offhand, uh, just kind of cool, not a big deal, but, you know, completely go through the tires here. Just kind of cool. I don't know, just one of those little guy things where it's like, I can stick my finger through the wheel. So, it just looks cooler. Uh, and that's the only justification it needs. So I went with a fabric style instead of a leather style. Uh, solely because I'm um, used to being on a couch anyways. It's also why I like leaning back. I'm used to being kind of laid back. So I'm used to the fabric, used to laying back uh, in a more relaxed uh, state for uh, playing story mode games, you know, stuff like that. Uh, in terms of, you know, more competitive online games, I like to sit up or even stand. So uh, this allows, you know, that alert sitting position, as you can tell. And uh, then, of course, you know, for the most part, it's metal. I mean, pretty much the only plastic is, you know, the cover pieces here. And uh, everything else about it in the frame all the way down to the wheels is metal. Uh, so you know, that's just kind of your main overview of it. So uh, let's sit in it and, uh, you know, kind of talk about it from there. So, of course, you know, more of that alert feature than this. Oh, no. That wasn't good. What? Well, you know, it happens. Uh, super quick. Get back on there, though. Anyways, you know, so get up there, this nice alert. Pretty comfortable, honestly, for when I need to get that paper done. I'd normally sit up like this anyways. So now to have a chair that actually supports me and uh, doesn't hurt my sit sitting style and my posture uh, is going to be pretty good. Uh, so, but, you know, for the most part, I might not sit like that more, have kind of a tilt back. Uh, first thing you're going to notice of sitting down is the seat is fairly firm. Uh, it's super good, though, long-term use. Uh, you can tell it's got a good bit of cushion in it. it kind of 
bounce a little bit, feel the cushion in, but uh, you know, you get one of those chairs and it's like sitting on a cloud when you first get it. And six to eight months later, it's uncomfortable to sit on because it's got no support. Uh, you don't have to worry about that. Uh, lumbar pillow itself has a good bit of support. It's fairly firm. Uh, so that's pretty good. Uh, you don't want one that's too flimsy. And of course, over time, it will get, you know, less firm, but, you know, headrest and the lumbar easily, you know, unzip, pull it out, put a new one in if you need it. Uh, then, of course, the headrest itself, you know, kind of cushiony. It's just there to where you're not putting as much of a strain on your neck. So that's nice. Uh, you know, while we're sitting up here, uh, armrests, they're adjustable. Uh, they don't twist like some of the newer newer chairs, high-end chairs do. Honestly, not a big issue to me. I don't feel like I would use it. I mean, yeah, I sit like this, so I guess it could be, but honestly, it's not a big issue. Uh, down, up, I like mine on the highest setting. And then all the way back or all the way forward. Uh, mine will probably stay forward more since I like to move. And I'll probably be sitting like this. Uh, more in a forward sitting style somewhat. Uh, but uh, you've got either or. And then you kind of have this little slide. Uh, just a little bit more of an adjustment to how you want the, the armrest. And the biggest part about it, though, is uh, it's actually a good bit of give. So it's not one of those, it's just that hard plastic that's going to kill your elbows uh, for using it. Uh, so that's nice. Uh, then, of course, you know, leaning back, I like to lean back. And, uh, you yeah, you get that time where you want to take that nap. Uh, you can do that fairly easily with this chair. Leaned it a little bit too far, but, yeah, pretty comfy. You know, nice little nap. Uh, not too far back. And then, of course, you've got a little bee lover right there and there. And now you can rock. Uh, super relaxing. Just something about being rocked, you know, to make you want to fall asleep. Uh, but not going to do it because I don't want to fall asleep here on the video for you guys. And, uh, yeah, you can even, if you like those unique sitting angles, I do sometimes too, but, you know, you can sit there and lock it in place and have kind of this, you know, more upright sitting angle all the way up to this point or more of the natural sitting uh, style. So they allow you to do either one of those, uh, whichever suits you best. So, you know, from the rocking motion, being able to lock all the way back and then the seat being able to you know, sit all the way, five degree forward tilt. Uh, they offer several features that a lot of chairs don't. Uh, all in all, building this chair, uh, the armrests come pre-attached, saves you five or six minutes. It took me maybe 15 to 20 minutes to put the chair together. Uh, definitely the fastest. Most of them take around 30 minutes for me. Uh, so there's really not a lot to do. And, uh, yeah, pretty simple for installation wise. It rolls uh, fairly smoothly uh, compared to the other chairs I've tried out. Uh, so, but the main thing is, is just sitting in the chair, putting it together. I honestly don't think I'm gonna have to worry about replacing this chair for a few years at least. Uh, so that's a great thing. You know, you, you can get some of these companies and you'll spend up to even $200 on a chair and it's a chair where it's like after a year you're ready to replace it and they're only going to give a one-year warranty on it because they know it's cheap and they're not willing to you know support you like that but this chair uh, definitely well made the stitch from the stitching on it the metal frame all the way down to the casters itself uh, just super super durable and uh, not cheap so that's kind of my main things about it. Uh, you know, I haven't used it a lot yet. Uh, definitely looking forward to using it, though. And uh, so, of course, we'll have this video posted. And, uh, you know, afterwards, whether it's an hour later, two weeks later, two years later, uh, whatever, 
you come across this wondering, hey, about this eWin brand, uh, you got questions for me about the durability of it, just let me know. I'll be more than happy to let uh, keep you guys up to date. And, uh, you know, just super excited uh, to have this now put together and in my room. So I will catch all you guys later. Game safe.